Hey friends, how are you? I hope you're having a great day today. I am going to show you how to create a skunk. Yes, they're kind of smelly, but they're pretty cute. So let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is make his head. So we're going to make a curved line and then another curved line coming down to almost like a point and then another curved line just like that. That's going to be his head. Now let's put some ears on him, just like this. So they're like really long and skinny C's. And then a line for his nose and color that in. Let's make some little beady black eyes. Make that one a little bit more oval. Now for his body, what we're going to do, and watch what I do first, is we're going to start about right here. That's a little bit higher than the middle. We're going to come up and then come down, just like that. You know what it kind of reminds me of, this shape? It kind of reminds me of the letter J, but it's upside down. Now what we're going to do is we are going to make a straight line down. And you might be thinking, what part of the body is this? He's kind of looking forward. He's kind of looking this way. All right, then what we're going to do is make a sideways letter V. And then we're going to do the same thing, straight line down and letter V. Those are going to be his front feet. Now we're going to come up with a straight line. And then we're going to make this straight line coming back like this. Now we're not going to go all the way though because we need some room for his back feet. So let's work on his back feet now. We're going to make a straight line and then it's going to turn into a V and then come up. And that same shape we're going to make again for his back foot. Now can you see how his body is shaped? Let's make his tail before we put his characteristic stripe down the middle. So you can make a smaller tail, but skunks usually have a big old fluffy tail. So we're going to start in the middle of his bun bun area right here. We're going to come out. And I don't have that much room at the top of my paper. So if you have more room than I do, then you can make a huge tail if you'd like. All right, and then we're gonna come back down and start mm, almost where you, where you started before. You stop where you started before, maybe give it a little bit of room here for attachment. Oh, I think he looks pretty cute so far. What's he missing? Let me move my paper down a little. He is missing his little stripe. So let's start with his stripe. So skunks are black and then they have a white stripe coming down the middle. So let's make a stripe on his head. So basically it's a zigzag line. So ziggy zaggy ziggy zaggy. And then coming down his back as well. And then of course he needs a zigzag line on his tail. All the way to the tip. And let me get another one going here. Aw, he's actually pretty cute. All right, I hope you like him. Have fun with your little skunk. Bye.